back at it again with another video. Today we're going to be doing the nail haul. If you didn't know, for the past five months I've been doing nails. Check out the nails. <laughs> I actually did them yesterday. I know you guys have been clawing at me. Like all of my friends have been saying, how do you do nails but your nails looking like it? And I feel you guys. I feel you. But what we're not going to do is come for me. Oh, cool. oh Okay. So today we're going to be doing a nail haul just so I know a lot of people are curious like when I use certain products a lot of my clients are like what's that what are you doing so recently I got some new pickups and I'm really excited to show you guys so let's get started comparable to the price here I rather get it there you feel me like one time I went to um a nail supply store hi Aaliyah. yes those actually exist there are nail supply stores that are not beauty supply stores went to a nail supply store hi Aaliyah, and they had like a dnd base and top coat for 12 dollars. and then i went to a warehouse and discovered that there was the same match because they come in like a case that looks like this this is how D&D is packaged. It comes like this with two polishes. So the base and the top coat um, were someone, somewhere else for $10. Yes, $2 is definitely a big difference. Trust me, especially when you're in the nail life. A lot of nail stuff is are fairly cheap but they add up because you need so many things to kind of pull together that really nice full set or that really nice manicure. You feel me? So... I'm gonna start by the most familiar places which are like today I actually did this within the span of like a good two weeks I kind of wanted to wait I know you guys I told you guys I was gonna drop this on Friday but I wanted to wait until everything came in so um today I actually went to Walmart I bought like a few um other things that I need such as well I think I only bought one thing from Walmart to be honest I got this <laughs> And I know you're wondering what in the world is paper towel for. Well, I use this paper towel when I'm actually um, dipping my acrylic in my monomer. When I'm kind of correcting, you have to wipe. And that little um, cloth that you see a lot of nail techs wipe on, some people use actual towels. Some people use like more durable fiber cloths. I honestly just use heavy duty paper towel. That, that works for me. It's been working for the past five months. So that's what I do. I just make sure I'm stocked up on that and I ran out so I needed some more and my mama was tired of me using her. So, you know, that's a story for another day. So, um, let's move on to the Hylia store that I went to. It's called Talk, Talk Beauty Supply or something like that. I'll make sure I drop all the stories in the descriptions for my fellow nail techs. So I bought two of these. These are like some soak off, um... I don't even know what to call these. They're just like, okay, it says finger manicure bowls. These were a dollar each, if I'm not mistaken, a dollar or two each. And of course, use these for um, soak offs for manicure. So I got them because normally I have the clips that I would that you just put on to soak off. But I think this is just way more efficient. And I actually used it. Like a lot of the items here I've used already because I'm a very active nail tech. So if my appointment comes, I'm not going to be like, no, I need this for the vlog. Let me not open it like you guys can't blame me come on come on now so yeah that's for soak offs um i've used this already um i also got this i'm not sure this is like a new thing in the new world it's ink gel basically like it gives you that marble illusion like on a white platform or any kind of platform they actually come in all different kinds of colors and things like that this was actually a about six dollars if i'm not mistaken from that same um nail supply store got that i also got this spider gel spider gel literally looks like spider gel like you take it out and you kind of cross it that's also a new style that nails techs are coming out with i'm trying to like stay updated my family like see the package like every day and they're like this my mom told me it might be an addiction guys but you know it ain't no addiction it's just a, it's just a passion you feel me it's just a passion yeah so <laughs> i got that from there i also got this sharpener um i know you're wondering what in the world why do you need a sharpener listen my friend actually told me today that i need to start thinking as a crafter and not a nail tech and she was so right because there's so much stuff that you need as like everyday life stuff and not just nail tech stuff so i have these wax pens that i use for diamonds just to pick up diamonds and apparently they need to be sharpened so 
when is the last time I bought a sharpener? I cannot tell you. So when I seen this, I said, let me get it. It was a dollar. So that, that was cheap. Oh, stuff is falling. Okay. Um, what else did I get from there? Oh, I got two gels from there. Um, I'm going to take it from this area here. Well, I actually got four now that I think about it. So I got this purple. It's like a metallic purple type thing. It's called Orchid Lust. I think it's really, really cute. Um, they were having a sale. I believe they were $6. $6 per gel. And I didn't have any purple, so I was like, I'm going to get some purple. I got a regular purple, but this is more like a plum. It's like a really cute purple. And then I got this green. If anyone knows me, you know my favorite color is green. So how the heck did I not have green? So this is called Spring Leaf. And let's see. I know I got something else from there. Oh, wait. Huh. No, I didn't get the top coats from there. Was that it? I think so. I believe so. Okay, so we're done with that. Moving on to the next brand, aka store. Um, so I went to, there's another nail supply store. It's called Hollywood nail supply this one is closer towards my house the first one was in Hialeah this one is closer towards my house so um I go to that one from here I got this right here I told you guys I already started using certain stuff so this right here it is like the cutest thing it's basically you find this in any nail shop but before I got this I was using like these like these regular dappin dishes um that's what they're called dappin dishes so this I like it because it has like a little um a brush holder this is like the brush i used um so i got my clear powder in here my when it decides to open my nude powder in there and my monomer in here trying to show you guys okay that's impossible monomer it's in here <laughs> so yeah this is awesome because it also kind of holds the scent a little bit um I know people that live here with me, they, they always complain about the smell, but this kind of helps. And I don't always have to keep changing and changing the um the the liquid because this I can just cap it and it doesn't evaporate. I know monomer, monomer is the liquid, by the way, that we use for acrylic. Monomer evaporates, apparently. I learned this quickly without wanting to learn it. Like, it evaporates. One time I left some in my dappin' dish and it literally disappeared and i was like and monomer is expensive especially when you're a nail tech that uses mma free monomer at that so yeah that was very efficient definitely helped maybe it has something to do with the metal i'm not sure or the steel whatever it is but that is a good investment this was i believe five dollars i believe because while I was in the stores with my friend Angel and we were literally on our phones, like everything we see comparing, 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 like what, what the different prices were. And I got some of my stuff on Amazon as well. So that's another thing. So next, oh, let me show you guys the packaging. I purposely kept the packaging for you guys just in case any of you decide to go to the place and get it. So let me, it's actually right behind me. Got this packaging here. happy i'm finally showing you guys so i can throw it away so this was the packaging for the dappin dish it was already just like a box it's a set it says nail art three piece mini powder and liquid set it's 100 percent stainless steel space compact professional and clean look so this is definitely a good investment i like this and i compared prices so go visit that store now the next one i'm gonna show you guys which is very important um sometimes ling ling doesn't necessarily do it but jessica does sanitize your tools nail tech ladies we have to have this 
this is also efficient as you can see it has this metal top i think it has something to do with the stainless steel that really keeps it from evaporating because this liquid as well this is chasticide aka barbicide very similar used to sanitize all of the tools so it's super super efficient has like a little net metal net down there so as soon as i'm done with my tools just pop it right in there and then it sanitizes wait your little 10 15 20 minutes take it out brush it off and then you're good to go nice and clean um especially when you're pressed for time like between clients that is very efficient and this is the packaging for that it says total Im immersion or immersion um sterilizer jar so this compared to prices as well um if i'm not mistaken this was like eight dollars i'm not sure because a lot of these asian places like the mo most of them are ran by asians or just foreign descent um they don't have prices on their stuff and they don't give detailed receipts which is hectic a lot of them they do no refunds so that's pretty much why so okay let's see did i buy anything else from that store yes so i got these right here listen this is oh my god one of them fell up this is a cheat for all my nail techs okay this here is a pack of 100 100 grit nail files and with me i was normally one to smooth out like after you apply acrylic smooth out the nail with a drill well not that you save yourself the work like first of all sometimes you can over drill i don't know about y'all but i got a heavy hand and i'm always drill happy so these here save lives okay it's literally 100 100 grit it's like a buffer a buffer file but this is like much stronger and much more sturdy you also have the option to get a thin one but i prefer these because you it doesn't feel like you're like using this flimsy sheet of paper to file something so it says 100 100 sharp smooth durable premium nail files this was 13 dollars. i'm not sure if that's the real price i think she was trying to get me to buy these but I know they're either 13 or 15, but my price was 13. So you can definitely ask about that. I know next time I go, I'm gonna say, hey, uh, sis, last time you gave it to me, but 13, don't even play me, okay? And this came with 50 of them. And I was gonna buy one on Amazon, like the same thing on Amazon. And I believe they were the flimsy ones at that. And it was like, I think $7 for 25 of them. So this was definitely a good deal for these. Okay, that one's good. Um, I also ordered some of my bling off of AliExpress and thank you know, I don't know if anyone else orders off there, but listen, it will take forever and a day. So if you're trying to order stuff and you got like a client saying, I want this and that's where you order from, don't do it. That's my advice. Take it and do what you want to do with it, okay? So, okay, so these came from AliExpress. It was these two here. They're literally like, I'm trying to give you guys a good look. They're literally like tiny, tiny, tiny diamonds. And I love them. They're like amazing. This one is black and this one is silver. Um, I will try to drop the vendor on here for these. They took about three weeks two to three weeks full weeks that was a headache um moving on if you know me you know most of my products are valentino beauty pure that's just like a company that uses mma free products and i love that because i love to make sure all of my clients nails are healthy and not ruining their nail beds pretty much is the goal so i got these two new powders this is called soft touch it literally looks white but it's that see-through milky looking white so i love that and i got this one called hidden pleasure i'm actually wearing both of these right now um this is hidden pleasure it's like a nude sparkle and soft touch is kind of, it's this one but it's like see-through like soft touch is on pretty much most of them but yeah so that's Valentino. They were each, I believe, $15. These are the cover, the cover um powders. 
as you can see they're pretty big they're both kind of like they're like the size of my hand almost and they're pretty tall um as you can see they're how many ounces well these only come in one size so it says 42 grams oh 1.5 ounce they're both 1.5 ounces each so yeah oh i also got these i'm sorry i kind of skipped over this i also got these buffers from um the store that's near my house the west park um nail supply store they had i believe it was three for two dollars i had got six but i got clients so yeah um wow i'm sorry guys i literally skipped over everything like i got this from there too i know this is all over the place i'm so sorry so this is like a holographic glitter i think this is so cute literally holographic y'all for y'all gotta forgive me because i just feel some of my glitter for y'all for y'all <laughs> So I have another one. This one I didn't just buy. I was like arranging my um, desk, so that's why it's out. But this is a silver holographic one. Yeah, I'm not making that mistake of dropping it again, okay? Uh, a lot of this, like this, I've had for a while. I just never knew how to use it. And I just knew it was super, super pretty, so. And they were actually having a sale. So these were only $4. Well, this one was $4. This like a long time ago. I don't remember how much this was. This one was $4 for sure. So moving along, I went to a warehouse that was like far. It was like an Opalaka. It was some, a warehouse that I went to when I first started doing nails. And they have, it's honestly a beauty supply outlet type warehouse. Not more so a nail supply. But if you want general, general, general um, stuff, then you can get it from there. So I got these foils. This was a good investment. I actually, um, if you follow my nail page at Air Acrylics, H E I R A C R L I C S Acrylics, just just spell it out. Um, so yeah, I got this and I used it actually today um, on the purple metallic set using this some white Valentino um, glitter. I mean, clear powder and this valentino gel this is number 68 this is also new number 68 that was 15 dollars this was four dollars for the whole roll it's 500 stickers i got some stiletto tips this was six dollars if i'm not mistaken six dollars and i also got this one it says full cover stiletto tips these look more like almond to me so that's why i got them i think this is perfect like the other like i have on these stiletto tips right now so that's how they look and they're literally like ready you barely have to like file them they're not sharp or anything these look like almond to me so i think that's great i don't get many customers that ask for almond i know coffin and stiletto are very popular right now but this i think is just really convenient because i feel like it's like the other one you just pop it on literally put your acrylic mold it and you're good you don't have to do much fouling and everything kind of sets the tone for the almond look already so i like that i got that from there got some glitters i was super super happy to see this these holographic glitters because i actually ordered some from aliexpress but i had to cancel because it was like a week down the line and they never shipped it but these are like tiny glitters they're like the more fine glitters but they're holographic so i love them this was two dollars and fifty cents guys huge great investment like this was awesome i love this um so that was definitely great so we're done with that now i went i actually um found this i guess instagram knows i love nails so they always send me these like i guess they're like sponsored ads like when i'm clicking through the stories those like put like a sponsored ad and it's literally um like different nail techs famous nail techs so there's this girl her name is meraki like her name is jc Apri, but her her nail line is called meraki not sure what that is but jc apri that's her name it's j-a-y-y-c-e-a-p-r-i and that's like it's jcapri.com that's where you get 
this stuff from. It's a monomer. This monomer has really good reviews. Let me let you guys look at the label. It has really good reviews, so I decided to try it. One of the reviews was saying that it goes on like butter. It's also MMA free, so I figured why not? Let's do it. I mean, it's actually cheaper than the normal monomer I use, so I'm currently trying to kind of find a different monomer to use. So I haven't used this yet. I'm waiting till my Valentino monomer runs out, but definitely looking forward to this. I will let you guys know how that goes. Last but not least, we have our Amazon package. So from Amazon, I got a few gems. Like I actually love this stuff that I ordered from Amazon. So I have number one, this right here. It's it says nail art tool. This was actually what it was in. You know, it was a, it was in an Amazon box, so it's like yeah. But this is literally for like a well to me. I don't know what else it can be used for but it's for doing a gel ombre and i think that's so neat because i have so many gel colors and not enough things to do with it really like if you want to do a design you can do gel but it's better to use like paint or something but this i cannot wait to try doing ombre it's literally like a pen with like sponges has replacement sponges probably gonna be have to, having to buy sponges a lot because of the fact that I'm using different colors, so it looks like these are easily washed. Maybe with acetone, possibly. I just noticed two of them are pointed. I don't know if you guys can see that. Two of them are pointed and two of them are rounded. So I'm going to look more into that and figure out what the motive to that is. This was, I want to say, $5. I'm dropping all the links in there today, so guys are going to be able to see for yourself what the prices are i know amazon prices fluctuate so um i got one of these this was one dollar and fifty cents um i actually started to make my own cuticle oils let me show you how they look they're gonna come like this in a pen this is the peach scent it promotes nail growth a lot of my clients their nails have been growing rapidly and it's because of this baby right here so I want to start using it more on my clients. So I bought a bottle so I can make it in there. Um, these bottles are super, super like helpful. If you want to put acetone, you can put whatever you want in these bottles because they're it's really gonna help. Let's see. And okay, next from Amazon, I got a tripod. I want to leave it like this because tomorrow I'm gonna be filming and it's like the perfect position. But it has like a phone holder. This is so awesome. This was like $14. My friend Angel persuaded me to get it. Listen, when y'all surround yourself with people that have like prospering businesses, they're going to give you so many ideas. Like even a business mindset just period. Okay. And this girl just be, she just be giving me all the little coins or whatever. So all the little, um, when I say coins, I mean ideas. Okay. Um, so next I got a. I should have a long time ago got this, but I'm just not getting it. A practice hand. It says, includes 100 tips. You can replace the little tips that comes on it. Haven't opened it yet, but this is what it is. It's how the back looks. This was, I believe, $23. $23. So that was a good one, good investment. All of everything that you see here, I've price matched. So the places are like the best places for you to go to buy them. So definitely take that advice. Um, okay, so I also have, I'm gonna have to show you guys over here. Ooh, sorry about that. I have this right here. My brother's in the background if you guys see him. But I have this right here. This is a nail stand that I built. Oh gosh, I just dropped my practice hand. <laughs> This is a nail stand that I built. Um, it's literally five tiers. One, two, three, four, five. Had to make sure I'm able to count. It has all of my gels on there. Had a lot of gels a lot of people didn't know about, but I made sure that I put that on there. Um, it has five tiers and it was, I believe, $13. Not too expensive, not too cheap. So, last but not least technically i mean i bought a candle too but i don't know if y'all really care about that 
But yeah, Bath and Body Works. <laughs> but last but not least, I got a new light, which is awesome. I don't know. All of my clients know what my old light looks like. But I got a new one. Um, the person I actually did a class with, um, Nails by Angel, she actually had the same exact light. But I was like, I already got a light. It doesn't really matter. But my light is kind of flimsy. And right now, I'm so focused on making everything, like, just professional, professional, professional. Actually going to make the whole, um, make over the whole room. And, of course, I'm going to do a video about that. So, I'm excited about that. Um, but here is my light. Oh, I'm, just it. Oh, I'm dropping stuff y'all sorry this is the buttons on the light so you hold it for two seconds to turn it on and it has adjustable brightnesses this is how the light looks overall it literally just goes across like that and then you can turn it off it also has an adapter in the back to charge phones, which I think is super, super neat because I always want to charge my phone and sometimes um, I just want to let my clients charge my phone, charge their phone. So I know a lot of clients come with their phone dead. So that helps a ton because it's literally on the desk. It doesn't get in the way of anything. And I think that's completely awesome. Um, so yeah that was the haul guys thank you so much for watching gonna um do my best to put all everything inside of um the description box if i forget anything just drop a comment remind me help me figure it out um but i hope this doesn't record sideways now that i think about it because i know i flipped the camera i'm scared y'all but hopefully <laughs> but thank you so much for watching join me in my journey as i just prosper as a nail tech this is gonna be awesome can't wait um let me know what video you want to see next and i'll try my best and record it i love you eris gang thank you so much for watching